So now the question is, how do we get these guys to start rotating when they fall and only when they fall? This is another thing that um, we might want to change very often. So we'll add some more attributes to our control here. Uh, I went ahead and renamed it Leaf Control. So we can modify, add an attribute. We can say Rotation Speed. close that and then we can go in and add the same attribute on our particle so if we go general new rotation speed which is a float per particle we'll add that In the creation we will want rotation speed to equal a random value between negative leaf control dot rotation speed and the positive of the same value at that make sure it works and this way we can just say that rotation speed is 10 and when we get our outliner back out and select our particle so it'll get a random each particle get a random value between negative 10 and 10 because we set it to 10 and then we can take whatever that value happens to be and add it to whatever these values happen to be in the runtime expression but only do that once it meets our falling criteria so we can say custom custom orient custom orientation plus equals our rotation speed of which is this attribute here we edit that move everything out of the way hit play wait for our frame to get hit which I changed to 15 now we can see that they start rotating once they fall.